Strange and I'm from Mildura in Victoria. I'm a pro wakeboarder and I was a 2014 world champion. Parker Siegley here, current national champion from Barossa Valley, South Australia. So here's a couple of things that can go wrong when you're out in the water and here's a few pointers to uh, make your day more enjoyable. Yeah, power turns are just really big, fast turns around the river. When someone falls, when you do a power turn, you're actually leaving your rider open um, in the water. So that's more dangerous for the rider because other boats will be coming through and you, you're not on the line that you were going. So power turns really upsets the water. Other riders, um, it's actually quite dangerous, uh, especially when, there's, when it's busy out in the river. Yeah, one common problem with going out in the boat is not having enough fuel. So start of the day, just make sure you've, you're all filled up because you can get out there and lose track of time. and. Before you know it, it's empty. As long as you have enough fuel, you'll, you'll always be safe out there. So ropes and uh, props don't go well together. Um, so I've done it a fair few times when I'm not concentrating. Once the, once the prop gets a hold of the rope, that's it. Your rope's buggered and you've got to buy a new one. And yeah, it's no fun. So yeah, just make sure you know where your rope is. Even when the rider's finished, get the observer to roll it in. So the, boat, the rope's in the boat. Being out in the boat for a whole day can be fun for everybody, your crew and everything, but there's always that one person that actually owns the boat, uh, they have to pay for everything, they clean everything. So if you're heading out on someone's boat, just make sure you bring supplies, some food, some fuel, um, some drinks, so some water and stuff, just make it a fun day. Another common mistake when out on the water is actually leaving your rider behind. Because sometimes you might have your observer, they might be on their phone, not really paying attention and yeah, before you know it, the rider's fallen and they're halfway down the river. So yeah, always keep a lookout to see if they've fallen and you can get back to them safely before other boats come out near them. Also, another common problem is people not knowing their routes on the river or waterway. What you want to do is you want to stick to the right side or just off center to the right side unless it's unsafe. A lot of this stuff that we're talking about is common sense. So if you stick by all these, then you're going to be safe on the water no matter what. Thank you.